For the past 12 months, we've seen yet another year in the automotive and motorcycle industry. In this special year-end episode, we will be taking a nostalgic ride of innovation, style, and performance through a recap of the diverse array of cars and motorcycles that graced the roads and captivated many automobile and motorcycle enthusiasts. So buckle up as we look back on the top remarkable releases that fueled our passion for the open road. Dito po sa Manibela. Pagdating sa mode of transportation, the motorcycle industry is one of the thriving markets dito sa ating bansa. This year, we witnessed some of the popular two-wheelers on our test ride episodes. Atin pong babalikan ang top 5 most viewed two-wheels on our list. Starting our list, we have here the queen of the touring enduro. Kung dual sport motorcycle ang hilig mo, the 2022 BMW R1250 GS ang isa sa top choice na available in our market. It offers an entire package and some people even call it the endgame bike. Bukod sa stylish look nito, this motorcycle is also equipped with a hard-to-match capabilities and comfort you could experience while on the road. The 2022 BMW R1250 GS is powered by an air or liquid-cooled BMW shift cam flat-twin cylinder, four-stroke boxer engine. This bike is paired with a six-speed manual transmission. It also comes with an electronic fuel injection system. When it comes to fuel capacity, its tank can hold up to 20 liters of usable volume. It also has standard riding modes, the Echo, Rain, and Road. But this bike can be upgraded with optional riding modes, the Dynamic, Dynamic Pro, Enduro, and Enduro Pro. So, itong motor na to, pwede siya sa beginner since yung power naman niya, very smooth. Unlike if nag-sport bike kayo na 1,000cc agad, medyo delikado yun. Pero kung beginner kayo, pwede nyo pag-practice to, medyo mabigat lang siya sa una kung di kayo sanay. Pero uh, saddle time lang talaga, lagi nyo upuan, lagi nyo gamitin, Ma magigets nyo rin yung motor eh. Very easy to, to use siya. This 2023, isa sa mga inilabas na scooter sa market ang AK550 Premium, which adds up to Kimco's wide scooter lineup. This new Maxi scooter with a price of 649,000 pesos is said to deliver the thrills of touring, concept to a new heights. Under its aggressive body panel, this premium AK550 still shares the same engine with the standard AK550. That's a 550.4cc liquid-cooled two-cylinder powertrain. And 55 Nm of torque at 5,750 rpm paired with a CVT transmission. Kimco created this premium AK550 with a thrill of touring in mind. Kaya kumustahin natin kay Jeffrey ang ride feels sa kay nito. Kuya, masarap. Masarap ang riding feel ng AK550 premium. Mapa city driving man or long driving. Napakasarap po. At 
gamit na gamit po talaga kuya yung mga features ng AK550 yung suspension niya kuya malambot ah uh, pagka tumatakbo na siya parang tumitigas naman siya para sa stability nung scooter ng maxi scooter kuya okay na okay po siya komportable po at uh, after long drive kuya pagkatapos ng ride nyo feeling exhausted at meron tayong kuya yung, yung backrest sa likod sa upuan so hindi tayo ngalay sa torque wala akong masasabi bilang driver owner na ito napakasarap hindi ako mabibitin regarding sa sa mga curve kuya napakasarap napakagaan ng handling hindi ka mapapagod What do you think of this ride mga kamanibela? Do you think this maxi scooter would be a suitable choice for your upcoming travels? Comment down your thoughts below. Ang tawag nila po ay two-wheeled SUV. Nakakita na ba kayo nun? Featured ride po natin ngayong araw yan. Ito ang uh, tinatawag na bagong rugged yet classy SUV scooter ng Peugeot, ang XP400 GT. Down to our top three on the list. Balikan naman natin ang naging performance nitong motor from Moto. Classica. This variant has a 17-inch front spoke wheels and 15-inch rear spoke wheels, both with Pirelli tires, all adding up to its bulky and SUV-like characteristics. Maliban sa big wheels nito, binansagan itong two-wheeled SUV dahil na rin sa high visibility at compact proportions nito. Under its muscular look, is a 400cc liquid-cooled engine capable of 35.6 horsepower at 8,150 rpm and a 38.1 newton meters of torque at 5,400 rpm with a top speed of 137 kilometers per hour This light off-road This XP 400 GT Parang uh, ang tinatapatan nito ay XADV Dito naman nasa pavement na tayo Mas mahirap ang pavement So far Oop oh. Torque naman siya. Maganda naman ang power niya. No? Power naman siya. Ito kasi, pwede na sa expressway din ito. Yeah! Handling niya naman. Okay naman ang handling niya. Hindi naman siya mabigat i-handle. <sighs> Maganda naman ang kanyang traction. Power! Brakes. Ganda naman ang brakes niya. Ganda naman ang brakes niya. Snowman. Snowman. Ito ang snowman. Snowman. So, sa handling, Ganda naman siyang i-handle. Yung bigat niya, pagka tumukod, hindi mo lang masyado mararamdaman.
for our top 2 most viewed episodes, hindi mawawala ang 800cc adventure scooter ng Honda, ang 2022 XADV. Honda introduced this bike as a standout innovation that gives a combination of appealing urban and off-road experience. With the balance and stability of a scooter and the toughness of an off-road motorbike, this unique crossover bike is said to deliver the essence of modern adventure. Ganito rin kaya ang first ride impression ni Joey. Subukan natin yung XADV. Maybe it's still too early to tell. First impression, ramdam na ramdam mo kaagad yung bigat sa kanya. And masyadong, masyadong tawag doon, nakabupa ka. Oh, ibang iba ang karakteristik ng motor na to. Compared doon sa mga nauna. Oh, ibang iba siya. At least, mahahato nag auto gear shifting siya. Third gear na. Ayos ah. Ramdam na ramdam mo rin yung bigat niya guys. Oh my goodness. Hindi ako sanay sa gantong, gantong klase ng riding. Eh. I have to admit, hindi ako scooter boy. Ibang iba yung feeling niya. Pero yung so far ah. And based dun sa dun sa mga sinabi nila pinaka loaded to ng technology compared to the other bikes na naano natin so eto yung XADV na 2022 pero ang sabi nila maglalabas daw sila ng limited parang special edition na kulay yung kanilang decals for 2023 but basically everything is the same yung specifications niya yung technology niya it's all the same From fuel-powered classics, let's shift our gears and rediscover the top one on our most viewed motorcycle list. Highlighting the thrill of riding an electric bike and the eco-friendly revolution on the road. Charge into the future with us with this Expressway legal e-bike from Gran Sportivo. This is the 2023 Grand Sportivo EGSX 9000 or internationally known as the E-Fun Puma. Ito po ang kanilang entry for electric maxi scooter category. For those wondering if this is an expressway legal bike, ang sagot po kaagad, yes. Pwede. Ito yung maxi scooter nila. Na electric maxi scooter nila. Uh, papasok tayo ng expressway gamit itong uh, electric scooter na to EGSX EGSX 9000 wow oh kapareho lang din siya ng uh, uh, 400cc ang katumbas na niya tsaka registered siya sa LTO sabi nga with ORCR eto Parang naninibago lang ako kasi sobrang tahimik, no? Ang tahimik dahil wala ka halos marinig kahit na uh, marangkada ka na. Tsaka malakas ang torque niya. Mapalo ka agad ng ang bilis. 200 agad. Ang bilis pala nito. Nakakatakot. Parang siguro ako mga hanggang 80 ng takbo ko dito. Mm. Pero malakas siya. Nandun yung power. Tapos ang tahimik Tapos pagka Torque siya talaga Pagka, oh, pagka Binigyan mo siya ng throttle oh, Yung kanyang Response Nandun agad Very responsive Those are the top 5 viewed Motorcycle reviews On our list Mga kamanibela Alin sa mga featured Two wheels natin Ang pinakanagustuhan ninyo Comment down below